Hello, Teton Cedar Village. This is Mike Mobley, the administrator. Um, I just wanted to share with you all today um, some more information and some comments on the upcoming vaccine for COVID. I know that a couple weeks ago, you all received a video from Dr. Kotzen, which kind of went over the clinical and the science behind the vaccine. First of all, I want to let you all know it is a personal decision. I personally will be taking the vaccine. Dr. Kotzen actually um, was already scheduled this week through Mercy Hospital to take the vaccine. A lot of the physicians that I know and am friends with have all taken the vaccine. So I wanted to share that as the medical professionals and the physicians that they feel comfortable taking it. But I wanted to kind of reach out more on a personal level as to why I am taking the vaccine. First of all, for our residents here at Cedar Village, over the last year we've watched our residents be isolated in their rooms. We've heard from their family members and the tears that they have not been able to see their loved ones, the isolation of our residents. I want to be able to get Cedar Village to the point where we can have our families back in and I want to watch our family members hug their loved ones again. Also for my immediate family, we missed out a lot this year on junior prom. My daughter is, um, just turned 18 yesterday. I was unable to go on any college visits because you were only allowed one parent. I want to be able to go to dinner and feel safe again. I want to be able to go out with my friends and I want to get back to normal. Another why for me is as a healthcare professional and a healthcare provider. I strongly feel that we have an obligation as healthcare professionals to lead the way in this vaccine and the safety of our country, the safety of our residents. I feel that we have an obligation as a, as a society, as a country to all bind together and to take this vaccine to get some sense of immunity so that we can get our country back on its feet again. This vaccine is the first step and a key step to getting us to where we need to get as a country. I wanna make sure that I do my part to provide the safest working environment that I can for you all. And the more of us that get vaccinated, the safer it's gonna be for all of us and all of our residents. I'd much rather trust this, the science behind the vaccine Consider our residents, your family, your role as a healthcare professional, your role as a coworker, and your role as a citizen. Team, this is a once in a lifetime moment. We all have a decision to make. We all have a choice. I hope by me having this conversation with you, it leads you to think about your why. If you're on the fence, if you're a hard no, I want you to think about your whys and at the end of the day, it is a personal choice, but my personal ask is that you think about it again and um, consider your whys. Our first clinic date is January 7th, next Thursday. Every employee is on the roster to be vaccinated, regardless of you accepted, declined, or said you were uncertain. So if you, if you change your mind, or even if you want to come in and ask questions on next Thursday, please come. If you want to be vaccinated, we will get you vaccinated. If you have any questions, feel free to come to me. Come see Missy, the Director of Nursing. We want to be a resource for you. Everybody have a good day and a great new year. Thanks, Mike.